Hello and welcome to this series on Shopify theme development. In this series, I'm going to discuss topics around building and customizing a Shopify store through the use of what's called a theme. So first things first, what exactly is a theme? According to Shopify, a theme is a template that determines the way that your online store looks and feels. Here's how I like to explain it. Shopify is a fully featured e-commerce platform. You might think of it as just a place to build an online store, but in reality, Shopify allows you to sell in many different sales channels, whether it be through point of sale, through existing online platforms, or through your own storefront using the storefront API. Of course, most users will operate primarily through the online store sales channel. If you log into your Shopify account and look at the navigation on the left, you'll likely find a link to online store underneath the heading sales channel. Click on that link and the menu will expand to show you the various parts of your store that Shopify provides. Notice that the first link reads themes. A theme allows you to control the look and to some extent the functionality of your online storefront. The best way to demonstrate what a theme does and doesn't do is to switch between the different themes on the same store. Let's do that now. See how when I click between these themes, the content and menus are largely the same, but the presentation is quite different. This is what your theme does. It's Shopify's way of allowing you to customize your storefront. Let's head into our list of themes and look at the source code. I'll explain the structure of what you're seeing here in a future video, but for now, I want you to notice the different file types we have in here. We have liquid files, JavaScript files, CSS files, and JSON files, amongst a few others. These are the files you're going to edit if you want to change your theme. Now, of course, Shopify has a pretty awesome feature called the Customizer, which allows you to edit aspects of your theme without touching any of the source code. Let's take a look at that right now. What you might not realize is that all of these customization options have been set up in the actual code of the theme. This means that you can actually remove options, modify them, or add completely new options by digging into the theme code. Very cool. All right, so now that you know what a theme is, let's discuss the other aspects of your online store in the following video. Thanks for watching guys. If you enjoyed the video, please give a thumbs up and subscribe for new videos. Also, if you can't wait for new videos on Shopify, definitely check out my course on Shopify. I'll link it up in the first link in the description. Happy coding and I'll see you in the next video.